It may look like a scenic lake, but it's not. It's someone's yard here on Jenny Lane in Lumberton. To get to his parents' house, Blake Grant can't drive. He has to wade. He says their house has already flooded twice. Uh, runs the floors, runs the baseboards. We have to get it replaced. Uh, good thing we have insurance, but this is it's probably in the house right now, too. This time, water didn't make it into the house, but it did make it into the garage again. We had to replace the garage door. It started rusting at the bottom. Jason Black has lived on Jenny Lane for 15 years. It's been flooding like this uh, pretty much every year <laughs> at some point in time. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't take too terribly much rain. This is a good rain, obviously. He says his home doesn't flood, but some of his neighbors aren't so lucky. Me being here for 15 years and seeing this happen to, you know, residents and prior residents that lived at these homes, you know, before it just either going through the same thing and it, it's really frustrating and it, it's 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 a problem that should should be handled and and I don't know that it should take 15 years. The Lumberton city manager says they're aware of flooding problems throughout the city. He says it's an ongoing issue and they're doing the best they can to address it. He says they're conducting a drainage study in this area. It, it would be nice to you know, maybe get off the 10 year study plan and, and do something about it would be nice. Grant says his family has complained to the city. Uh, multiple times, yes, and they just don't care. People tired of wading through water and waiting for a solution. In Lumberton, Lauren Hewitt, Fox 4 News.